Hey guys! You know who and what it is. It's, it's the Cool Couple, Couple AC, AC, and we're back with another story time! You. So much requests for story times. Yes. Yeah, so and we're giving you another one. The one uh, this is this is one that a lot of people wanted to hear about actually. Yeah, but this is about the time we actually first met. Like yeah. not not when I first knew I wanted her, not when I wanted to start a relationship. None of that. No no no. This is about strictly the very, very first time we've ever like we can remember crossing paths for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no romance but in it at all. Both. Before we get to the juicy story at hand, let me tell you guys one of two things, okay? Number one, you see this finger? It's pointing down. You know what I'm pointing to? That subscribe button that, for whatever reason, is still red. Why don't we go ahead and click it and subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date with what's going on with us and you can get all these videos fresh off the press. Number two. Number two. Numero two. You already know I have to do my business shout out. You know she has to do it. Number we love supporting people. We love mm. supporting small businesses. We love supporting our people. Like All the time. I'm so proud of Shannon for this line. This is the Juicy Lips line. Okay? She makes natural lip glosses and I'm actually really happy about them because I, I love lip gloss. I'm starting to like learn makeup on my own and like mm. I like trying out like different things, so I'm so happy I could be a part of her journey and to try out her her line. Um, she has four lip glosses. This is one of my favorites, okay? But she has four lip glosses, and can you guess how much I got them for? Wait, what's in that one? Roses. Rose petals. Huh? Flowers. Re like, I'm telling you, her, she, her it's legit put, natural. They should put flowers in there. Yes, they keep my lips so moisturized. I'm so happy. Is that, are, are those gold flakes? No, they're... Like, this natural. Everything in there is, like, natural. Yeah, that's what I mean. I see... There's no way. Yeah, it's way. Uh, yo, how does she get the... Yo, that's... Hey, hey, hey. In the comments, uh, Shannon, please, how do you get the roses in here? Let me know. How did you do that? Did you? All right, so now this is gonna be something I'm stuck with for a week now because he's not gonna stop until he figures that out. Do you push the roses in that little deep? Is that how you do it? <laughs> do you push the roses in the little hole? No, cause no, I'm dumb. So I imagine that to fill this, you have like a little syringe and you buy the, you get the tubes and you, you she just with the, with the like gloss, that. but like do you, That's not for you to know. She, you, get, yo, she just you, gangsta How do you like put that. the gloss, yo DM, how do you put the roses in here? Cause I'm, I'm not asking Google cause I don't she want She just gangsta like, like that guys. I'm, as you can see, I dropped her, her Instagram. Go follow her Instagram to support her. That's get crazy. some lip glosses if you can. All four of these I got for under 30 bucks. And they're evenly dispersed. It's not like you just jam the roses. roses. She didn't just jam the roses in here, eh? Like they're not just at the top, like yo, you they're not even just for display. Yo, these roses are evenly dispersed. This is crazy. How did you I'm not even wearing any of these. I just saw the rose petals in here. You guys can see how lit they are because it's not even just coming from me from him. So please, guys, go support Shannon and go follow her page. Can I have my lip gloss back, please? Before you freaking make it leak all over the place. Don't, Why would I make it leak? Don't touch my lip gloss. I'm, I'm, don't I'm, touch my lip gloss. Okay, but when I just want the petals. I wonder if I can get You're the petals out. You're not getting it. I can get a petal out. I know I can get a petal out. Anyways, thank you so much, Shannon. You're lit. All right. You're lit. So. Now. For the bread and butter. Business. This is this is down to brass tacks, because the reality of it is you guys wanted a story time video. So yeah, you guys want to know guys how you get a story time. This is not Pause. No, it's not a romantic story. Not, no, it's not. not. It's not gonna go down the way you think it is. It's not. Whatever you're not, thinking, just this is not gonna come not. from no club dates, cause honestly, I we've known each other longer than that. This is not like a like, yo, I saw her at this club at this night, and we heard this song. That's what a lot of people think, that we met at the club, and then now we're Gretchen, married. Gretchen, I'm going to rip the <laughs> band-aid right off the boo-boo. We met in high school, fam. Like, <laughs> the band-aid right off the boo-boo. I'm, so yeah, I'm going to rip the band-aid right off the boo-boo. I'm just going to go, whoop, here it is. 
You went to high school. Yeah, fam. We went to high. All right. So to get a better grasp of of who we were in high school, I'll I'll give it up myself first. I'll I'll expose my own hand. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't I wasn't popular, but I was well known. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't I wasn't the most flashiest guy. I didn't have the latest clothes or nothing like that. But you know what? I still I get I my clothes can get me by. You know what I'm saying? And I I I, I um <laughs> I was everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Like anytime there's a rap battle after school or someone's dance battling or anything. You no, know like people that. that just have to be seen. I I generate no, like crowds. Didn't. People like they just no, people gravitate yeah. towards me because I'm such a fun time. You know what I'm saying? That's that was my blessing and my curse. I didn't know One what word. I then. Extra. Very much so. That was me, but I wasn't annoyingly extra. I wasn't. You know those kids that went too extra to get someone's attention and they look weird and like now people are like, "Yo, what are you doing? Like roll on the floor or eat dirt or some dumb shit." Like, and I'm not that extra. I'll just make fun of. I was extremely rude. That was my claim to fame. I was extremely rude. I was a. Uh... See. I was a tomboy, like ball shorts underneath the track pants, underneath the uniform pants, socks tucked into the shoes, bandana out the back pocket, black gloves on my hand, and never wore the uniform top, but some type of hoodie or some type of jacket, okay? And I always had a, some type of sneaker, you know what I mean? And a kilt never touched. No, I lied. I can't lie. I wore a kilt probably like five times during the time of me being in high school for four years. I wore the box cover. That's it. Okay. It is so, what it is. I'm so, here now, but it is what it is. I was not. All right. So again, to I give, am now back then. To give more context to the story, you guys also have to understand we didn't go to the same high school, but our high schools were literally, and I mean physically across the street from one another it was the craziest thing bro i can't make this up i i've never seen two high schools that close in history i've never have you ever seen that mm, have you can you i can, i i i can't recall the only closest school besides all saints and donald a wilson was jay clark that's, Richardson, that's exactly what was i was thinking about notre, notre dame because yeah. they were the same school bro <laughs> like they were attached <laughs> That's the same what I was thinking of. That's so funny. <laughs> I can't, it? like, anyways. Mm -hmm. So, the day starts like this. Any regular school day, you know what I'm saying? The people are hyped after school for the after school shenanigans. We don't know who's going to rap battle who. We don't know who's going to try and pull what girl and get rejected or get the number. We don't know what's going to happen. But we're all down for fun. We're, we're all silly gooses at that time. No one's she went home. You know what I'm saying? We're all just trying to have fun. Just the boys. Yeah, you, you know what I mean? So we go down to where is the second bus stops where the chilling area is. I'll draw it up. So there's my school, Donald A. Wilson right here. There's a main road. And you got to cross the main road to get to her school, which is right here. The first bus stop is on this side, closest to my school over here, uh -huh. right? Mm -hmm. But there's a bus stop down here where it gets poppin'. <laughs> That's where your boy went. That's where the crowd started to form. That's where someone found themselves in the crowd because they want to be there with their you can't, girls. You can't even for liking music. I didn't come there to look you. Yo. You think I came there to look you? No. Were you somebody? Because you? I was under the assumption that she only liked hood men because of the way she would talk and the guy she would talk to, bro. You ever, I've never seen this girl talk to a woman. Well, well, how nice to see you. I've never it's, even, you know what I'm every, every person and her brother looked like a goon goon, bro. <laughs> Dog. You know how scared, her brother was one of the tallest ball playing niggas in the school, B. Like, what do you want from me? This guy's surrounded by tall guys that play ball, oh, that yeah. have anger problems. Because every guy on the ball team was fighting. Like, no, what do you want me to do? Tell them I'm trying to get with her. Listen, All I had to do man. was go, you know what? See her, peep her in the cut and go, Yo, I have to get like a face tat or like. <laughs> I just I gotta, get a face tat. Yo, I gotta, yo, I gotta Stop. get a, I gotta get a criminal charge before I taught this girl. I can't. You're, you're, you're crazy, bro. <laughs> I, yo. I wasn't even that bad. You weren't that bad, but here's the thing. You, you 
obviously look like that girl no girl could talk to or behind you know what i'm saying like no girl could chat you up sweet and be like i was not the popular one in school let's get that straight no 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 but you weren't popular but when people saw you they went oh we, no no don't 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 do that don't like i can say i was i can say me and a couple of People, you know, who I'm talking about. Exactly. Yeah. She had her little click. See, she we, had we, her little click. We had click. no matters. She Sorry. had her little click. I had my little click. Yeah, you know what I mean, we had girls no matters. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's so, not the point. This is where it all gets great. You know when kids from two different schools get together, they're going to try to break that up because they think fights going to happen. Someone's selling drugs. Someone's involved in gay. All types of things you're gonna be thinking about. Thought we're at the poppin' bus stop, okay? Poppin' bus stop. The principal comes up and says, yo, y'all gotta go home. Y'all gotta leave. Y'all gotta stop this. Me and my smart self, I speak for the boys. I'm like, oh, we gotta go home? That's cool. Me and the boys, we gonna take the bus up at the main road. So we start migrating up. But we didn't take into account people actually have to take the bus. People. Who's re- people? Who's people, Alan? People really. Because need- I know you had a house to go to. No one told you to come to my space and come bother me. You decided to take your tralala ass from the second bus stop to the first bus stop. To from go the block- poppin' bus stop all the way to the main bus stop. It wasn't- he decided to go and take his tralala ass from the second bus stop to the first bus stop where I had to you know what? No one told me to go there. You know what? Your mom was calling me and she went home. Big one I didn't want to go home here. I wasn't ready to go home. I wanted to have fun. I wanted to have my fun outside of school like I do every day. And it wasn't going to stop because she wanted me to come home. Why? Because I was not a big man, but I was a big man and I wasn't a big man yet. You understand me? <laughs> All right. Cool. So, now that we can get on with the story. Anyway. We went to the first bus you're stop. Wild. We went to the boring bus stop. But now... Because there's, you know when a big group gets together in high school and then the kids break off it's from that big group? You know the loser kids go away. Listen, hey, the cool I'm shaking my head because... Loser kids just, go home and they dip and they do whatever. And then the cool kids so go, you know much. what? We're going to chill again. And then they chill again. So all the cool, cool kids are like, you're chilling again. You know what I'm saying? I'm and we're making, so we're making more noise. Now, it's very imperative that I tell you guys that me and my boys loved wearing red we all wore all articles of red we went to a public school so we got red shoes red laces ripped jeans with the red bandana around the knee we got the red jacket we got the hat do rag red all of it's just red that's what we're doing that's what we want to do so it looked kind of bad when shorty's color my favorite, favorite color, color in high school is blue okay yeah, um, and mind you, as I said, you know, didn't, baggy jeans, gloves, you know, bandana, uh, like yeah. tomboy, like I was like. It it just didn't go good for anybody there, cause the teacher obviously. Now I get. Let me draw the picture again. Principal of All Saints, okay? Middle-aged suburban white woman who has no information about hip hop, street, or gang culture. Even know who Lil Wayne was. So ever automatically insinuated because there was a large group of young black people conjugating at we were getting ready to fight either one of us was getting ready to fight the other one or a big drug trade was about to happen <laughs> that's a big drug trade so what she did was decided to you know poke around and say hey if you guys don't leave she did not do that well that's no, what no, no, you no, no, saw no, no. No, because she did that once, and this is why it led to what it led to. Because she did come back. She gave fair warning. She said, listen, you guys, I remember talking to you, you know, down at the other bus. I know she wasn't you, that nice, but it's okay. And if you, no, no, no. Because she was, the, the this is the first time she approached us. She was nice about the first time she approached us. It was somebody who shall remain nameless in the crowd, who doesn't go to all states, who yelled out these words, suck my dick. That made her get mad and go back inside school. This <laughs> guy yelled out something to the principal, okay? Hey, I said, Yo, Mr. Person, Wayne, I didn't do it. I'm telling you. But anyway, he yelled out that to the principal, okay? I'm just saying someone did it. Why is that? So have what? To be me? Because it was you. And then, any, anyways, anyways, and then, whose name do I hear? Her teacher? I'm like, what? There's no way. 
So I turn around and she goes, you know the finger just... So you I'm know, like, what are you... You know when principals what? think they have power? Oh, like, principals think they're bot and they call your name and they go, what? Cartesia? Yeah, and they go... And in their mind they go, get your ass. Yeah, that, that, she gave me that face, bro. She doesn't, she doesn't like me. So I'm like, okay, whatever. So I go over there, I go, what? Like, I don't, okay, fine, I give attitude. I'm like, what? You you need to tell you and your people no. What did she say? You and your need you and your people need to go home. Tell your people to leave. Yeah, gather gather so your now, people. So gather now, your people. So that now, was phrase. That's what I that's what I I said. Mm-hmm. What, you say? what does my people mean? She goes, those guys. I'm like, okay, so now it went from people being in front of the bus stop, so now I need to figure out what the fuck what's my people, bro. Let I don't care about nothing else anymore. Tell, break down what my people mean. Mm. Oh, so you have people rapping, and I'm gonna call the cops on you and tell them that you're part of the Crips and you're here and the Bloods are over there. And this is her words. She said, "I'm a part. Of, I'm a part of the Crips, and they were a part of the Bloods, and we're getting that's ready to have a gang she, fight in front of the bus stop." That's what, see, the, that's what the principal told me. That's what the principal told me. Educated about that's what the principal things. told me. Okay. She actually did try to call cops. So no, no. So so I brushed it off. I said, ah. I'm like, I don't even care. I don't care. So I walk over to the bus stop, chilling. Who do I see coming? Constable Stinking Foot wants to come and run up on me and say, "Come here now. If you don't tell your people to leave, you're gonna get in trouble and blah, 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 you're gonna get suspended." And I'm like, so I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, I don't care. I don't give a fuck about what you have to say. I'm like, come say it to my face. This guy's standing there, watching, not saying anything. And he's the one that caused the problem. Well, here's the thing. They had called you by name, and I was in the business of, at the time, following a rule that stated, if it's my name or not my name, I'm not replying if I don't know you. So, adult says, Alan, or it's you, sir, in the red. What do I do? Yep, they left me there. The bus came. I got in trouble. But I didn't stay to get in trouble. I left. So I think that's why I got into more trouble because they yeah, wanted no, me I to remember, stay. I remember everyone crowded that bus when I came because that bus was late. Everyone was yeah, waiting for the that bus. bus. The bus is always late. Um, so. Everyone was waiting for that bus. You know, yeah. you know, you ever, you have you ever been that child who's been the last to get picked up from like ball practice or like soccer game or something like that? You're there seeing all the other kids go home and you're sitting like, oh, okay, my ride's coming, my ride's coming. Just wait. That's wow. how we all were with that bus. Everyone was like, no, the bus is gonna come. Five more minutes. Not five more minutes. 45 minutes late they just no seriously man uh, no 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 the schedule said it was 4.45 so I guess no it's just if it's the 5.15 that's gonna come it's 5.15 <laughs> it's like making excuses oh, for the bus and then when the bus finally got there you know how many people jumped on the back of the bus and on the front of the bus the bus driver didn't even care no, about the, getting the, fair. getting getting the money like you, you think, just yo, said get on I think yo just, there's too many of you and like, I'm not gonna fight this just get on the bus well, mind you I had to go home I had to pick up my sister but and yeah. then, and I got in trouble the next day. She wanted me to go push Dutty Bucket in, in the laundry mine. I never did that. Yo, honestly, I never did that but shit. Yo. Whether I worked, I out, number one, I always got in trouble for not wearing my uniform. I always got in trouble because I, some, okay, fine. I didn't go to some classes. Like, it is what it is. See, bro, see, that's it the is thing, what it is. Bro. People and hear like, this story and they think, well, obviously, you didn't have any feelings for her from there because, like, you didn't do anything. Guys, you guys have to understand. I used to send guys to, like, try and holler at her to see. Like, well, if you send guys thing, to me, that's thing, not my type. I'm gonna say no. No, because here's the thing. Like, I thought I knew what tough guys were. Okay, so I would always like I'd bait them into it. You know what I'm saying? Like that was the thing we used to do. Like, yo, you can't get that girl's number. And the guy goes, what are "You talking about? Of course I can't. Of course I can't." And he just does his thing. So I would relentlessly just every time I see her, bro, I'm like, "Yo, you, you can't get her." Number. I was like, oh, you can't get her number. It's like, dog, I've been, you can't get that number. So the guy walks up thinking he has game. And I'm like, yo, how are you? And I do this now. I go, how are you going to do it, bro? How, how are you approaching her? How are you doing? And though, I've seen guys do it. Oh, yo, how you doing? Hi, my name is, yo, Wagwan. And every time it's, it's the same look. <laughs> I don't like people. So that made me go, okay, he he's not tough. It's be okay, so. Him? Nope. He fought six people this year and didn't lose a fight. So are we discussing the fact that the first time of me actually getting to know him, he got me in trouble? I mean, we weren't getting to know each other that I didn't like him because... 
No, because I didn't like after that I didn't like you because I'm like, yo, this guy's so extra. This guy made a big scene. He said something but to the principal. What? She but thought he was what? my friend, and then now I'm in trouble because but, of something and, he but did. Then I went and back. he never even owned up for that. You should back. go to Mr. Wayne right now and go tell her that it was you. No, because I did something to her house. <laughs> <laughs> No! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Um, <laughs> you weren't you weren't there that time to brave me. But what I will say is, every time there after we were rapping or there was a battle or something to be had, I knew if I waited long enough, I could see her outside of school. So that started to be a little thing. Like, like are you? Daddy, you have to understand, bro. You have to understand. I was, I was, uh, I was, uh, how could I put it? Stalker. When I see something. Oh, wait, no, no. No, it's not a stalker. stalker. I never followed you home. I never came to you. I never tried to make friends with your brother to get to your house and go home. You knew where I lived. Mean? Yeah, only because I went to a birthday party to at somebody. I went to your, I went to your neighbor's birthday party, not knowing that that was your neighbor, only to see you outside. Like, what are you, what are you, what you doing here? I said, I didn't. <laughs> I, cause yo, cause you know what? It was like yo, I know exactly who's going to the party. I know who's going to be there. I know these guys. I don't have to dress super fly. It's a guy's thing. I don't have to dress up and try to impress things. Did you and, come to my 16th birthday party? It was in the hall beside in the next complex. Now let me tell you how I got there. Okay, let me tell you how I got there. It was your brother's fault. Oh, he did come. He came to my 16th birthday party. Oh, it was your brother's fault. Yeah, Jamal. Jamal didn't give me a choice. Jamal said my my sister's having a party. It's at this day, and you're coming. I didn't. That's so funny. He didn't tell. Like, just, if anyone knows Jamal, that's how Jamal is now. He doesn't ask you. Yo, 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 yo. yo hurry up, man. Let's go. <laughs> like, hurry up, yo. It's like, yo, I didn't even say yes. I, yo, think, yo, I think Jamal's had that deep voice since high school. The man just, <laughs> man just rolled up and said, "Yo, my sister's birthday is on Sunday. You're coming." <laughs> this guy said you're coming. <laughs> Okay. That kid to my 16th birthday party. That's so funny. Yeah, bro. And I remember. I, remember. I, had, I didn't get a seat. I had to stand up. Good. Because, <laughs> yo, Jamal was the only person I knew there. <laughs> yo, I saw bear the people. Like, yo, dog, why are there so many niggas here, bro? Who are these niggas? I don't. Yo, that, 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 that day was funny, bro. Bro. So I think one of the first times I've seen a nigga with a tattoo my age is at her 16th birthday party, bro. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think I, I know who it was. Like, Yo, dog, this nigga has a sleeve, bro. What the fuck? This is wild. Yo, we got the cake, bro. We're playing pin the tail. Is that a sleeve, bro? He has some fake. This nigga had, like, all of it, bro. <laughs> but the thing is, you can't press these types of things. You know I mean, you can't, you can't be, if I was too on it, we'd never be sitting here today. I we'd never be sitting here today. It's crazy how we actually came back together for the first time again. Like, yeah, but that's, that's, that's that. But yo, that was the story lit, time lit, of lit. how we first crossed paths or how we first saw each other. That's how, how we, we first, first met. met. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't even trade names really because, like, the thing is, again, we both weren't popular, but we were both known enough that our names would come up somehow. By that kind of, like I knew you were Jamal's sister, and everyone knew what Jamal's sister's and name I was. And I knew you were the, the friggin' extra dude from across the street. Yeah, but see, no brothers or sisters. I put my own name up there. I'm saying right now, my own wave. So I'm saying, God knew just what he was cause doing. made me wave alicious and just you know what I'm saying, drip sauce. You know what I'm saying? That's what he had in store for me. God waited till after I got like grown up to give me. All this sauce and drip. If I had this in high school days, oh god, oh god, I'm ruining lives, bro. But thank you, you know what? It's done because you're just <laughs> you're so enough. Like thank why? God he reserved the drip sauce for her. You know what I'm saying? All for her. He's so crazy. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed our story time. Mm -hmm. Make sure how again, we met. Make sure again, subscribe. subscribe, like, comment, share it to your friend. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, on a serious note, back. I've been telling you guys to send your granny to the page, and I think you guys are taking me for a joke. Yo, I want the subscribers, dog. I know you all send funny videos to your mamas and your momas and your grandmamas and your grandma. Yo, send your grandmas to the page. We have quality content. I'm not playing around with it.
depend on. Okay? Just send them on. There's so many old people on YouTube and they don't know what to do. Just send them. There's so many old people on YouTube. What are the old people that you like on YouTube? Yo, Judge Joe Brown cat video. Okay, you know what? It's cut. <laughs> Judge Judy. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Anyways, until next time, people, have a good night and have a good day. Stay blessed, stay dry, and obviously, finish line. Peace.